English winners. In this lesson, we are going to clear up a major misunderstanding with numbers using the teens and the units of 10. This lesson is a stress lesson. In other words, have you ever said the number 13, but the other person heard 30? Now, what's the difference between these two numbers? And how do you make sure that this rarely, if ever, happens again? Here's how it works. With the number 13, 1, 3, the teen gets the stress. 13, 13, right? But then with the number 30, 3, 0, right? It would be the first syllable that gets the stress. 30, 30. Let's try it again with the number 14, okay? 14, 14, 40, 40. Now we're going to go through all the numbers from about 15 slash 50 through 1990. So that way you can understand how the stress works and you won't have to worry about making this mistake or being misunderstood this way again, at least it won't be your fault, right? It'll be their fault. So, let's begin. 15. 15. I'm saying each one twice. And now the next number. 50. 50. 16. 16. 60. 60. 17. 17. 70, 70, and so there's three syllables there, 70, so just imagine a descending staircase, 70, okay, next number, 18, 18, 80, 80, 19, 19, 90, 90. And so that's it for our simple pronunciation stress lesson for numbers. Did this help you? I want to know. Until then, please subscribe. And in the comments, let me know, has there ever been a misunderstanding where you say one thing in English, but the other person hears something else? Tell me. Also, if you like this lesson, check out my pronunciation playlist and also my playlist on stresses, which I will have created very soon. See you later, English winners, and I will catch you later with another video.